and we are live. Hello, guys. Hello, people. Yes, <laughs> again, the same thing. Hello, hello. hello everybody. Everybody. What's up? How are you doing? Welcome back to Staberia TV. I'm Adon Zangraj here from Greece, Athens, and we have also one more time because people requested, they asked for, and Staberia, <laughs> of course, they accept. And we have one more time, Farrell, Unexpected Life, and uh, from all the way from Perth, Australia. How are you doing, Farrell? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. I'm a little bit uh, in an al al allergy mood. You know, that's why yes. I look my nose, my eyes. I take my drugs, but still they don't do nothing. So I'm a little bit... Because it's today. spring. It's spring there now, isn't it? Because yeah, we're coming spring, into winter. Yeah, summer and uh, yep. yeah, a lot of... Oh. How do you say it? How do you, say, how do you call it? Hay fever. Hay fever, right? Hay fever. Yes. Hay fever. Hay fever. Yeah. <laughs> Hay fever. Exactly. <laughs> what are you going to do today? Okay. So we're going to alter a notebook. Okay, okay. So I, see, I, saw that, I saw that actually today. And uh, happy Wednesday. Hi, Craft, Craft I Am. Hi, Craft, Craft I, am. I Am. Hello. This is very beautiful. Every time, Farrell, you just blown everything mind, I think. Oh, thank you. Very sweet. Well, actually... I um, used vintage paste because I got in trouble last time for not using it, so I made sure finally, I used it. Finally. I have to do a special <laughs> request for you to use the vintage vintage paste. <laughs> Hello, Porto, Portugal. Hello, everybody. Hello. Anyway, so, uh, Farrell, before we start, and yes. you can tell me anything else you want, uh, okay. let's see what's the program. Do we have any program uh, for tomorrow Hi, and the rest of the week? Let's see. Pop that in. I don't know Hi, if you have any program. Someone from the background, please throw the program for the next days, or we don't have. Maybe we don't. I don't know. Mm. That's good. We can just keep saying hello to everyone. Because okay, I don't yes, very... We have a lot of people from yeah. Arkansas. We have hello, hello. A lot of people sending messages. As always, Farrell, I think people start loving you and they stop loving me. This is what I feel happening. And there's nothing wrong with that. I say keep sending me the love. Hello, Claudia. I think Arino. you get enough. I think uh -huh. we just keep giving it to me. Yeah, but it's okay. You know, I, I, I can accept that. I can accept that. But when I start traveling again, and this happening very soon, I'm going to spread the love again, and people will love me back again. <laughs> <laughs> I have no doubt. Well, you're traveling again this year. That's yes, pretty I'm cool. Traveling now, in two weeks, I'm going to Holland. Yep. This is the start. Hi, Mitch. Uh, from Mexico. Uh, so, yeah, I will be in Holland. I will be teaching there. Uh, this is a class that cancelled last year. We, we postponed it so many times. Probably I'm going to go to Spain because I owe there a class also in Bilbao. And then I go back in uh, in Holland again because they yep. miss me so much. So I will go twice. I will go in the beginning of July. And then the big travel starts September end of September, middle of September, I'm going for two and a half months in the U.S. And I'm, wow. <laughs> I'm so jealous. When I saw that post on Facebook, I was like, oh, hi, Rose. Hi, Valasia. <laughs> Rose Hello. Is enough, is enough love for everybody, but I don't believe so. Hi, Agnieszka. <laughs> anyway, so far, uh, yes. let's start. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. And let's show yep. to the people what beautiful techniques and ideas and what beautiful project you have for today. Okay. So, no. You can turn. You can turn the camera. Don't worry. Uh, okay. Well, I've got to set it all up. So. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's okay. Hello. Hello, people. How are you doing? You can see a very colorful background today at the back. Uh, yes, a lot of things going on. How are you doing? First of all, I got my vaccine. What about you? Are you safe? Are you healthy? This is the most important. Uh, something I forgot to mention, probably, is that uh, don't forget to share, like, and uh, you have an opportunity to win a very beautiful pizza box from Saberia. I think nobody told me to say that, but I think running every week. So I think, and anyway, pizza box or not, just share and like. Don't forget that. Please, guys, and put some likes. Give some love to uh, Farrell. Okay, what else? Send me some comments. What's going on in your life, in your craft life? Do you have time to craft? Do you still work in? Uh, the most important, are you healthy? And hopefully everybody's healthy and doing fine. Farrell, hello. Yeah, hang on. I'm just... Oh, Farrelito? no. I'm... 
the internet doesn't work, guys. I don't know. My internet works. I feel you can hear me, right? But I don't know what's going on with Farrell. There in Australia, so many things doesn't work. Oh, here you are, finally. Yes, sorry. I had, I, pre I keep pressing the wrong button on the phone. So, yeah, yes, yes. Okay, I understand. It's normal for you. Don't worry. It's okay. <laughs> Bear with me. Okay. Come on, Farrell, do something. I'm, I'm okay. Right. The ladies so, waiting for you. They don't even comment I, when I say I'm something. Sorry, you I'm commenting. sorry. I said I was sorry. Oh, my goodness. All right. So, oh, this is the book. Okay. So, I will give the background today. I, I, I prefer to be mostly in the background so people can hear me because my face looks really bad with the allergy. So, let's start, Farrell. <laughs> the stage is yours. You have five okay. minutes to, to blow our mind. Okay, well, just remember, if anyone posts a comment to let me know or a question, because I can't see of course. if that's okay. So um, I've got here just a hardcover notebook. So I um, love collecting these kind of notebooks. So it's this one here. It's very similar, very old. I don't know what story it is, but I find that they're really good to alter. Very good. So, to begin with, I'm going to stencil the background. You know what I have to say? What? As soon as you use vintage antique paste, immediately the project took another level. I mean, it's like amazing. Well, look, I, I got in trouble last time for not using it, so I thought I'd make sure that I have it for this, <laughs> this class. See, I do listen to you. It's not often, but I do. Agatha, okay. Agatha Burning says, amazing composition. Craft I Am says, love the colors, Farrell, and stencil you. Very nice. Oh, thank you very much. Very good, very good. So this is the first time I've used this stencil. Yeah, so the code is KSAT15. So everyone get your pens and your paper out to write all the codes down. Once I get it out of the packaging. Agnieszka says, love your project. With oh, thank you so much. Parts. So sweet. Um, so I'm going to use white modelling paste. So the code is K3P38W. Very nice. And I'm just going to use a spatula to apply that onto the, the cover. Farrell, this time, do you use the do you use the, the the camera closer because it looks better this time? Yes, yes, it's quite low. I learnt after the first live we did. That's good. That's good. Very nice because it looks very nice now. Do you know what? I need new spatulas. I've heard. You need the big temporary. one. Yes. Um. Dying to get my hands on that. Guys, guys from the back, if you can, please just keep the comments uh, a little bit longer because that fast we cannot read. It has to be at least five to ten seconds each comment. So why, uh, Farrell, why you didn't use, why you didn't, you didn't use the stencil in the whole book. I mean, what is the, what are you thinking and you just use So, I very rarely use the whole stencil because I like it kind of patchy, if that makes sense. I find if it's one big block, because I'm also going to come through with um, some crackle paste. And if I use the, um, I don't like wasting product as well, if that makes any sense. So, I know that I'm going to be covering here. I'm going to be putting paste. Uh, crackle paste down, but it also it kind of makes it the feature, I feel. I understand. Feature. There's nothing wrong with using the whole stencil, but I prefer not to use the whole stencil. No, no, stencil. I understand. Craft I Am says I need a, met a metal spatula using plastic ones. Uh, Craft I Am definitely needs a, a metallic one. I mean, the, the plastic ones, they are so thick, they don't work so fine. Just I mean, no. it has a lot of uh, sizes. Uh, just take one metallic. It's very important. It's gonna it's gonna save your life. I mean, it's gonna make make your life easier. Trust me about that. So I'm just gonna quickly dry that. I 
I blow my nose 10,000 times. You need to find stronger drugs. The stronger, the stronger drugs, they're going to make me sleep all day. I mean, I'm, I'm already... No, no, you get the non-drowsy ones. Uh, Annette, Annette, Annette says, don't you use gas on the book? Okay, so normally I would prime my uh, surface first, but because it's a material, I don't have to because it's porous. Um, and the colours that I'm using are very close to this colour, so I don't need to prime it. So right now you haven't done any preparation on the book, so you go straight forward nope. on the... Yep, just straight okay. on. Yep, if you can see, it's got like a, it's not fabric, but it's cardboard. I understand. So it's, it's like poor, poor surface. If it's poor surface, yeah. you don't need to do anything. Yeah. If it's if the if the book cover is glossy, then you need to put primer, primer first, dry. Yes. Then you can use the color you want, or you go straight with paste and you can paint it on top. But yep. you have to prime it. Now she doesn't need to do it. Okay. So next, I have the crackle paste. So K three P three seven in the white. And I'm just using the flat part of the spatula. Barbara says that stencil is beautiful. It is, it's gorgeous. And I love. The um, compass. The compass, yeah. Really this, cool. This pencil is a very nice combination of Baroque style, Baroque background. I think it has one bar two Baroque backgrounds inside. Uh, the one is a little bit more, uh, how should I say, with fla flowers. I, I don't know, floral. Um, it's, um, it's on the tip of my tongue. It is flourishes. Yes. And it has also the compass. That com it's very nice combination. Yeah. Now, so on here, I've got the crackle paste, but because I haven't primed this printed bit here, the crackle, when it dries, it just flakes off. So if you were going to do this at home, I would then put a primer. But I quite like it the way it is. So I'm not going to put yeah, the start, crackle yeah, paste about. on. Monica, Monica, 100%, you need crackle paste. I use crackle paste. Yes. Far use, everybody, I think. Okay, so I'm going to dry it before I get to the next step. So any questions, shoot while I'm driving. While I'm driving. <laughs> when you're driving. <laughs> driving, drying. Oh, my gosh. I, I, I heard you said driving. Yeah, I did. I don't know what happened. Well, I am kind of driving. Look, look, look what driving. I have to say. We are, we are already 15 minutes in. And yeah. still, I haven't teased you. That, that just imagine how bad I am with my allergy. I mean, you know what? Actually, no, you did. No, you and did. I when I, I said, what, "What's going on?" You did. You did. When I said hay fever, you mocked me. <laughs> but I said hay fever. It's not the hay you know. Hay fever. Oh my gosh! When I talk with Rose, Rose called me today, right? So yes. we had an amazing communication. It was so easy. It was so easy, you know. I think it's you. Hi, Amanda. Uh, Amanda, yes, says hi, and Donis Farrell, and everyone, my favorite Stamberia combo. Mwah. Thank you very much. Amanda. Oh, thank you. Amanda Richardson. Oh, look, it's already starting to crackle. I don't know if you can see down here. Uh, not really. It's not easy in the camera. But, the, but later on with the vintage thing paste, you will see everything as always. Yeah. So when are you going to create on a live next? What I know so far is that I have one live, uh, 27th, I think, of May. And this is uh, against Abelia TV. I'm going to be the host. And one lady, uh, one of the biggest stores here in Greece, we're mm -hmm. going to do together live, and she's going to create something beautiful, I believe. I haven't seen photos, but I know she's a very good artist, so we're going to have fun, and we're going to speak also Greek and English. <laughs> oh! 
Okay. So my base on here, the base coat. Um, so I've got K Caldo. Yep, K A L one three five. So it's like a light grey. And two chest. And K A L two five. Very nice. Uh, I think both of the colors was in my my previous uh, favorite colors of Allegro. I had a selection. I just, that collection. color is just amazing. Yeah, yeah. And you should try, you know, we should, you should try also the, uh, I don't remember the name now. Let me find it here in my, in my computer. Let me find it. Yep. So those two colors I'm just going to mix together. Mm. Oh, petroleum, petroleum green, K-A-L-87. You, you should try this color. Guys, this Ooh. is amazing color. Write, write it down, uh, Farrell, for uh, for uh, the future. K-A-L-87. Hang on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hang on. I'll do it in my book. What was it? K-A-L? K-A-L-87. See, it's handy having a notebook close by. <laughs> yeah, that's good. So then I'm just going to cover the whole book. Nancy Cordova says Cord Co Cardona. Oh my God, Nancy Cardona, <laughs> Cordova. Uh, hello, hola familia Estamberia. Saludos desde Colombia. Hello to Colombia. Saludos. Hello. You know, far I have been Colombia once only in uh, Pereira. Yeah. And I can say about Colombia, it's very underrated country. I mean. Uh, I don't know, people talking about uh, many things, but Colombia is a very beautiful country and very good people. Very I would nice people. love uh, to go. Hey, Andonis, Petroleum Green. What's that? This is Allegro uh, color. This is one of my favorite colors from Saberia. New one, new one. I mean, it's, one, it's new in my favorite list. Uh, KAL87. So this very beautiful color. Very beautiful color. You don't have one there to show? The color uh, in in the place I am now, no, no, okay, unfortunately. Hello from Croatia. Hi, Tanya. Hi. Gosh, we got people all over the world tonight, today, this afternoon, you know, this morning, wherever you, you are. Know, Farrell, but, uh, in Slavic countries, uh, you don't when you have a name like T A N. J A, you don't pronounce the the J as J, and you pronounce as I, like Tanya. Ah, look at you, full of knowledge today, aren't you? In some certain, yeah, when the letter is in some certain position in the world, I mean, it's not like any time you see J, you pronounce like this. I believe. Oh, we have also Noella Hernandez Carrasco. Hola, hola, saludos desde Madrid. Hello, back to Madrid. Hola, como estas, señorita? Oh, I like the way you, you're drying. I mean, everything you do far is so smooth. Oh, look at you giving me your compliments tonight. Love okay, it. Okay, now we have a big one. Stefan Nichols. We have, I remember doing a workshop with Andonis, cutting the inside on the pages, uh, of the pages out at Country View Crafts a couple of years ago, loving the color you're using Farrell. Hey, hi, Stefan. Oh, thank How you. you? And uh, yeah, I remember this class. That was a popular class, actually. Okay, I so I'm just going to use a baby wipe. Color. Sorry. I'm just going to use no, a no. baby wipe and take back some of that color. So even though we've dried it, where I put the modeling paste, can you see how that's starting to show because I'm rubbing it off? And it should also happen on the crackle. Very nice. 
So similar to what you do when you use the vintage paste, you're just taking some of that colour back. Not all of it, but some of it. I think I think people loving it right now. Oh, everyone's so sweet. I can't wait to start travelling and then hopefully I can meet some of these people in person. Let me tell them something. Let me tell them something, uh, Farrell. Oh, hang on. What is it during, first? During you doing this now, I can yep. see that in the compass, you got one spot, white spot. This that one? Because, yes, this, this is because the color wasn't dry there enough. So, yep. ladies, you have to be very careful. Of course, Farrell now, she does, she, she does everything like more fast because we have, let's say, the pressure of the time. Maybe we don't, but w let's say we have to finish at some point. Uh, but when you do at home, you have to be more patient with the, to dry the yeah. face and then try to color enough. To, you can remove just a little bit, but don't dry the acrylic color 100%. Because if you dry them 100%, if you burn it, you're not going to be able to take off. Correct. So see where I, that label was? I didn't prime it. So now I can actually take back some of that paint to show. Yeah, see the label underneath like a vintage. So yeah. Yeah, very nice. Yeah. Okay. So I'll just give that another dry. Sylvia says, uh, beautiful project. Oh, thank you, Sylvia. From from the name, she's Spanish, I believe. Last name, Costa. I think this is Spanish. So, next. Oh, bear with me. Let me just quickly go grab my ink. Okay, so for the next step, I'm back. So my favourite stamp, so WTKAT13. Very nice. And it's the Traveller New. Yeah, this is very good. I love this stamp. And you'll want to use an archival ink, so it stays on or any permanent black ink. I saw something from you that I haven't thought about it, and uh, I think you did it in purpose. Did, did I just show you taking the stamp from the side of the package? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> so um, I was a little rough, and I accidentally split, but now I just slide it in rather yes. than pulling it out. Yeah. Yes, I think I think this is a better idea. Yeah. Because sometimes it's hard to get the stamp back in, whereas that way I just slide it in and I'm good to go. Very nice. Okay. So because I don't want to do the whole area, I'm going to place pressure and I'm going to curl the stamp so I'm not having it completely flat. And Thank you, Roberta. Thank you. I believe it's very good stamp, very good background stamp. And then I'm going to also do the spine. Stefan Nichols says, love how the embossing stands out. The um the stencil. Yeah, yeah. It looks like it's mm. embossed. The way you did it. When yeah. you when you use a stencil and you use the color on top and then you take off with baby wipe, it's kind of you make it look like it's one is is one with a book, you know? Mm-hmm. Okay. So because that's um an archival before I want to do anything else, I'm gonna have to dry it. I'm gonna do that very quickly and then we will start with adding the composition to the um, the notebook. You know, Actually, you know who is inside, huh? We have also Giovanni looking. Ah, oh, Giovanni, Giovanni. Hello. Good, uh, Hello, Giovanni. good afternoon. 
Okay, so I have pre-poured some. Okay, so I'm going to let you know which molds I used because I've written codes. So one mold, it's this one here, and it is KACM05. So here I've used this one, this one here, and some of the cogs. Very nice. The next one is KACM07. No, you can't really see that one very well. This is this is your letters? Yes. Oh I've written on them so that I know. Um, yeah, and I'm just yeah. I'm using the, the stars the thing is from the that way, one. The way you write, you do, even you, you don't know. I know that one wasn't a very good pen. And then the last mold. <laughs> the pen's really? the problem. Yes, it, well, yes. K-A-C-M-0-4. So on this one, I've used this plaque. But for tonight, I'm going to use this one here, the Discover. It, it's, it's, weird. <laughs> it's weird if I say I don't have this mold in my hands. Uh, yes. As in you don't have it at home or you just don't have it with you now? No, I don't have it at home. I have a feeling. Oh, how could... Okay. Well, I think it is weird and you should actually have it. I will order it online. I have to have this... Because actually, you know what? I... Let's, ask, let's ask everyone. Which one should I use? Discover. The man with the wing or the discover? Discover. Disco <laughs> discover. Monica, Monica says awesome molds need to save up and get them. Love silicone molds. Thanks for doing them, Andonis. Uh, thank you for buying them. I mean, don't say thank to me. Thank all of you. You buy the collections and uh, you use them mostly. I mean, this is the most important. Not just buy them. If you use them and make projects, that helps a lot. And thank you very much, Vlad. You don't have to say thank you to me. Do you find that you would you use a lot of the molds or are you more chipboard? What? Do you use more chipboard than molds on your projects? I use more chipboard than molds, but the reason that I don't use molds is that, uh, yeah, okay. I use some molds, but just the preparation of the mold. This is the, but you know what we're going to do? After you finish the live, after we finish the live, I will call you, we'll have a coffee, and I will tell you to prepare for me 10 molds, 10, 10, oh, 10 elements from each sure. mold, and you send me from Australia. Yeah, yeah, okay, yep. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> Not. Okay, so um, I'm using the primer, so K3P28G. Um, on the resin pieces, so I have already pre-primed these ones. I'm just, I thought I'd show you one of them. And then I will also do it on my chipboard pieces to seal those as well. So I've got them all here. And I will in a sec show you which chipboard sheets I use because it was a few. Steph Stamperia has so many beautiful molds. Just order some from the craft store, and I can't wait to see what other ones are later tonight with a one-day special. Very nice. Ooh. Uh, so the first uh, chipboard is. Uh, let's have a look. Can everyone see that? KLSPDA four one two. Yep. So that's the first one. Second one is 415. Yes, the same So that's cog. just all co uh, cogs. The other one were, was clocks. And the last one is 414. 414. And the good thing is that also for people, for you, for all of you to know, is that you see Farrell now, she have used uh, elements, pieces from its, uh, its different kit. But she still has a lot of elements to use in other projects. This is the point. I mean, you're still using mm -hmm. them and you get pieces from, from each kit. And this is very cool. So I'm just using a makeup sponge to apply the, the primer. Yeah, Roberta, 
Robert asked uh, Farrell a question for you. Farrell, what do you use for embellishment, uh, like, like to make the molds? Anyway, this is what's your question. Soft clay, uh, ceramic powder, gesso, what? Okay, so I really want to try the soft clay, but I use, uh, depending on the project, so I have used clay, uh, Stamperia's um, soft clay, the, and I also use resin. The two-part resin because it's hard um, and it's quick drying. The one that I use, I so it only takes nice ten minutes. Soft clay. I think it's a very good idea when you want to bend a little bit the elements. Yeah. The embellishment. Yes. So if you want to wrap it around, say a jar, then that's perfect. Um, I tend to use the resin though because it is quick and it comes out. Pretty much perfect every time. Barbara, I have never created a mold until I discover Stamberia. Ooh, that's cool, Barbara. Ooh. I have learned so much from watching the lives and YouTube videos. Barbara, this is exactly what you should do. Just watching videos, go watching YouTube, uh, watching here Stamberia TV. Always you can get some ideas, some new techniques. You can learn and then you just uh, incorporate whatever you see in your art. I mean, this is all about. That's why we do it. Molds are very important for, I mean, the molds because they, they give some dimension in the project. This is the important thing about the molds. Well, I think, too, if you have a look, the detail that it comes out is just, it's perfect. What well, we can say, Farrell, we have detailed molds. You can yes. say it, say the truth. Okay. Yes, you have very detailed molds and they're the best. Yes, a lot of inspiration out there. Thank you, Monica. Okay. I'll just give that a try. Oh, and I forgot. Hang on. Ooh, that's chilly of me. But wait, there's still more. Mm. Okay, so SCB30. So it's the decorative chips. And I used one of the little wings here. Mm. That one. And the other one is um, SCB32. Again, decorative chips. So the title uh, for this one I used Vintage Travel. Um, this one I might do Adventure because our mold says Discover. So that's that. Pop that out. I'll just put a bit of primer on. And Donna, so are you doing something in the background? No, I'm just texting to my friend Omar. Tell him oh, that because I'm I so can see yeah. my allergy. So you better keep me on the background. Because <laughs> oh, I can hear clicking. Yeah, yeah. Um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm holding myself with allergy. I mean, it's really bad. You, you cannot see my, my eyes because you're crafting, but I think people can see that my eyes are a little bit like, my whole face is like sw swollen. swollen. How you Look, I'm not like, going to lie. I've seen your eyes better. But it's not terrible. Yeah, okay. Not terrible, but still. <laughs> it's not terrible because I'm holding myself to be like normal. <laughs> okay. Uh, so I'm going to start painting the chipboard. And I have... We have uh, Galen. Hi from Australia. I should be sleeping, but love your work, so we'll try to watch for a little while. Yeah, I mean, uh, 
Kaylin, Thanks, Kaylin. Watching file speaking is a very nice way to, to sleep. I mean, you, you're going to feel calm. <laughs> oh, oh, we're feeling a little better, are we? Yeah. Yeah, I can tell. I'm trying. <laughs> Uh, okay, so I'm going to, so the clock, I'm going to do the same colour as the notebook. Okay, so it was just a little bit of the turquoise, a little bit of the grey. Once I get it out. And then I'm also going to use, okay, so KAL43 Biscotto. Biscotto, yes. Biscotto. Biscotto. And that's going to Biscotto. Yeah, this is my favorite go. colors also. It's very good for rust. Robin, yeah, it is. Robin I... Tithalos. Hey, Robin. How are you doing? How... Hi, Robin. How everything going on there? We have the uh, chippers from Saberia are fabulous. Love the wings, cogs, etc. Thank you very much, Robin. How it's going in Australia? Must be very late. Because they're two hours ahead of me in Queensland. You know, you know that Robin's husband is Greek, right? No. Yeah, yeah. I think Robin's husband is he's Greek. We, I, I met him. I remember I met him, but I, if I remember well, he's Greek. I'm just gonna clean a paintbrush. Do you use water or do you go straight? No, straight on. But my paintbrush is wet with water. So, so you it, use water? It, well, I didn't spray water, but my paintbrush is damp. So you use water? Well, no, I didn't spray it. Yeah, oh. but, but you use water with your brush, the same thing. Well, no, like I wiped my brush on it. Okay. If you have a tiny little bit of water on your paintbrush, that's fine. How's that? Okay. <clears throat> oh, you found a better way. Yeah, I'll be here for ages. <laughs> and I'm not um, too worried about if there's a bit of resin showing because when we do the um, the vintage paste, it just adds yeah, especially a little bit the, more the tiny bits that are inside the coke that they should be dark yeah. anyway. So those yeah. are going to be uh, dark. Probably should have painted all this beforehand. Monica says 11, 11.30 p.m. Uh, in Melbourne, Victoria now. Still up to watch the beautiful mm. art and conversation you have. Well, we're not really chatty tonight, are we? Because you're not feeling the best. Yes, we're not so. Yes, because it's my it's my mistake. It's not your mistake. Sorry, ladies. I apologize. If today is not so entertaining, I mean, what you used to hear, our conversation and all the, the things we say and the fun and everything, if it's not like that today, I really apologize. My fault. Just my allergy killing me. And... Yeah, I, I said also for once to let Farrell to, you know, to let her, you know, just to be easy for her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, Farrell, when I'm... Yes. When, when I'm, uh, when, when's going to be the, late, the next time we're going to meet each other? I don't know. Oh, my God. Wow. So, on the news today, we've been told... That international travel. Oh, so you heard? Yeah. Mid next year, if you please. So probably we're gonna meet straightforward in the cruise, right? Yeah, well, I'm hoping it's before the cruise. Yeah, oh, it's gonna be. It's gonna happen. Don't worry. So probably you're not gonna come in uh, in the US in the exhibition, right? I will be alone look, again. Look, I'm gonna try my hardest. Um, because I uh, figure. If I have Farrell, the vaccine, what? Yes. We have someone says hello is Marta Garcia 
And she's, she says she's from Cardiff. Do you know Cardiff? Cardiff is one of the most beautiful little cities like an island, but it's not an island. Uh, yeah. In the Atlantic Ocean in Spain. Oh, I'd love to go to Spain. Actually, I'd just love to get out of my country. I don't care yeah, where I go. Now you don't care. Just, ah, I know you can travel to New Zealand. Why you don't go to New Zealand just for fun? Just to say, just to say that you travel. Well, actually, I'm pretty stoked. Next Wednesday, I get to go on a plane again after 18 months to Sydney. Oh, I'm getting in the plane, yes. Actually, yes, in two weeks also, I'm getting in the plane. This is crazy. Two planes, actually. Yes. I have transit in Istanbul. That's cool. I miss that. Me too. So I'm pretty excited. I'll be packing my bags this weekend. I've got a class on Saturday. And then I'll pack for a retreat. Um, Emily, it's, okay. it's so fun when you have the ladies, you know, just talking to each other, having fun. Oh, I miss that. You'll get it soon enough. What have you got? Two weeks. In Holland, I told you. Yes, that's what I'm saying. In two weeks. Oh, yeah. Yes. I thought, yeah, yeah. where are you going in two weeks, you asked? Sorry. So, yeah. <laughs> Actually, I'm really scared, right? Like how do you remember how I te- how I teach? Do you remember how to do it? I mean, I'm like, do you remember how to do it? <laughs> I will go. I put my smile on, and then I think everything's gonna be okay. That's funny. Okay, so I just grabbed some scrap, um, a scrap piece out of your twelve by twelve Sir Vagabond paper collection, and I'm going to. Mm. Use oh, mixed you want to find media. something beautiful for the background. Yes, I mean, really? mm. oh, maybe it gets a bit lost on that. You won't see it. No. Okay, so that's going to be a waste. But we won't do, do, it for you. do you want? Okay. Okay. So normally, if you have a bigger cog, so on here. Yeah, I've actually got yeah, 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 in the background. So I'll but do it now because just to you use different kind of uh, clock. Yeah, I kind of yeah, chipboard. I'm running, I'm running out of um, like some of the chipboard pieces. Yeah, but it's not bad. It's not bad idea. You do it so the ladies will see it, and you show them already in the original project how it looks because it's a good idea. Uh, so mixed media glue DC two eight M. Stefan, I, I, I agree with you, my friend. I mean, really, really, yeah, going classes, shows, whatever. I mean, so nice meeting with people. You know, when you travel so much, then it's kind of standard. I mean, like, you know, you know that's happening. You know that you will be in exhibition. You know what's the program. And you don't realize how much important it is, right, for you. So then well, when, when after it happened, now you realize how much you really miss all those things. Well, for you, it was normal, wasn't it? Being away so much. Yeah. Nicoletta says, love your project uh, so much and uh, love that it's just so accurate. Oh, thank you. I'm going to dry some of the, the paint so that we can get on to the next step. You know, you and know, I mean, keep me. The, I, I, I said, guys, I'm, I feel so sick. Keep me at the background. So you kept me at the back, not my face. <laughs> as you long as we can see. right now, Farrell, it's only you. Yeah. Uh, oh, we have Sherry. Uh, Sherry. Sherry Taylor. Oh, Cheryl. Oh, Hi, so, Cheryl. So how, how? Cheryl. 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 Yep. So she is one of the girls on uh, from New South Wales. She yeah. comes on. She was on the cruise with us. Oh, uh, and and she has the same the same last name with you. Yes, just spelt with a Y instead of an I. Ah, you are with a with an I. I never realized. Yes. It. Yes. You are you are Taylor. 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 Okay, we have Tracy. Okay. Oh, okay. Matone. K A L twenty. Yes, perfect. The most beautiful brick 
English brick yeah. colors exist. I don't know. Very beautiful. Um, Hello, I'm Donson well, I'm from Albany. Oh, hi, Tracy. Okay. Tracy says, love you watching you both. So funny. I know, Tracy, maybe not today. We're not so funny today. I no, today was quite fault. serious. Look, Tracy, you have to understand something. Farrell, she cannot be funny without me. <laughs> so now today, yes. I'm not in my best condition. You see, it's not so funny. Still funny, no. but not so much. Look, I feel for you. I know you're not feeling the best and the kind of friend I am, rather than, you know, teasing you about it and making you feel bad, I'm supporting you. We have, look now, we have many Sigala. She's from Athens and says hello to you and probably to Hello. Γεια σου, μένη μου, τι κάνεις. Καλησπέρα. Από Αθήνα, σε ποια περιοχή είσαι, μένη? Let's pick some Greek, why not? Let's throw some big yes, words. Go. Amazing color, Sylvia says. Yeah, it's very beautiful. I love this uh, Madonna color, Arno. Very beautiful. I think I might have to order some more. Come on, ladies, we have pizza box. Somebody tell me, Omar, send me. Do we have pizza box, ladies? Did you share? Did you love? Did you put likes? What's happening? Like, share. And give some love, always. Yes, I would love a pizza box. What, what, what do you love? <laughs> I have to have a pizza box. Pizza. Okay. Yeah. You look. You should start doing. You should. You should start diet and forget about the pizza box. No, the Stamperia pizza box. Oh ah, some, yeah, but Stamperia box. Uh, sometimes you can get margarita pizza, low fat. Share okay. the videos, you can win a pizza box. Ladies, you can see it now in front of you. Just share the video. It's not about the pizza box. When you share the video, you can go to us. Uh, yes, to, share the love, yes. the support, and you that keeps us love. coming back. Know. One share okay, some... you that you are, let's say, you are in Taiwan. You share, and we just get... So much love and new followers, new people. So just one share. It helps a lot. And now, because I'm using Nadea's phone, uh, that that calling her at the back. Oh, really? You need to yeah, get okay. a new phone. Sylvia says, Andonis de Allegro uh, colors are really beautiful. Uh, they're really beautiful. They have good, uh, how you say, good colors, variation of colors. And very important, it's very good quality. Not because I work with Samberia. I used to work with Allegro colors a long time before I I, uh, I meet with Samberia. So this is very good quality colors. Let me, let me send messages to her father. All right, so we're going to start with the composition. So the clock goes there. So I'm just going to start gluing. Uh, which one's going to be quicker? Okay, maybe we'll use the extra four. Uh, so I think I might do one there, this one here. I wanted a fat pizza box. <laughs> Annette says, Annette, yeah, everybody wants a fat pizza box.
So I'm just getting the conversation. Farrell, yeah. those are the yeah. moments that I understand every time how much I love the vintage strategic pace. You see now that everything looks just one. I mean, no details, no nothing. And then as soon as you put the paste, everything changes. Mm -hmm. Oh, there it is. So, Joanne says they have beautiful coverage. Yes, they cover a lot. They're, they're very good. As in the paints, Allegro paints, they got good coverage. Is that what you're talking yeah. about? Yeah, 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 yeah. And Vanessa good. says, I would love a pizza box. Vanessa, that's why I just share the video. Might you get it? Oh, Julie says, when are we getting a sneaky peeky, sneaky peek of your new Sne range? Ju Very Julie, insane. I have already everything on my phone, but I cannot share, sorry. But still, I have it. So it's going to be beautiful. I believe you're going to love it. It's different. It's, 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 it's connected, but it's different. I mean, I love it. I so love it. I love the colors. I love the elements. I think people, you gonna love it. I, I hope so. We put a lot of work behind, and uh, and I believe that it's gonna be good. You're gonna love it. I think very soon, actually, coming out, uh, coming like pre-orders. I think very soon. I don't know ex the exact date, but I think pretty pretty soon. Uh, Monica, composition is the best part. I love constructing and layering. Of course, Monica, everything is about layering and constructing. Yeah. Composition. Very important. I agree. It's probably, it, like, it looks like it's taking me not that long to do it. But when I did the notebook, it was a good, I'm going to say an hour, just going back and forth, back and forth until it's... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I do the right. same, exactly. I mean, sometimes can take, if, if it's a small project, can take an hour just to find the composition. Sometimes yeah. if it's a big project, can take two, three hours. A lot of smoking, a lot of brainstorming. Yes, and it's not until you walk away and come back and you'll move something and then that's all you had to do. Whoops, sorry. Yeah, but, uh, you know, colors and compositions, are the alpha and the omega. You agree? Yes. Sorry, I was just... I'm addicted to your pace, Andonis. <laughs> yeah, well, I got in trouble last time, didn't I? So I thought I would use it for tonight. But it, it's... Actually, here's a thing for you. Next time you do a project, I say don't use it. Uh, I have tried so many times to not you. use it. Yeah, don't use it. And Agatha says uh, it's looking better and better. Yeah, and just in, just wait, Agatha, what's going to happen at the end? That looks really neat. Uh, I, I have tried to not use it. It's not easy for me to not use it. No, it's not. I struggled last live maybe, not to use it. Maybe when I use alcohol inks, maybe sometimes I don't use it. I start loving using now if I use alcohol links, I start mm -hmm. loving, you, uh, loving, to you, loving to use the waxes from Stamberia. I mean, the, yep. the, you know, the metallic waxes. This is very beautiful. Mm -hmm. See, I don't think we can get the waxes here. Yeah. Vanessa, uh, it's, uh, they don't fly. That's why. Yes. It's against the, the flying regulations. Uh, Vanessa says, it takes time to get the project the way that you want it. Taking your time to get it the right way is the best way, of course. Mm -hmm. I agree. Oh, we have Alda. Hello, Alda. Hello, my dear friends. Hello, Alda, Alda. How are you doing? How are you doing? Another beautiful member of the design. I love Alda. She's yeah, so she's sweet. Alda, what are we going to do? Come on, now everything is open. Let's come back to Portugal.
Craft I Am says, loving those weeks, another one for the list. Yeah, that list can, right. sometimes can get longer and longer. Mm -hmm. But you know, you know how nice I feel now that I work only with Stamperia materials? I mean, mm -hmm. of course, sometimes I, I, you know, some metallic stuff I would, lo I would love to have. But besides that, I mean, it's so nice. I don't worry. I, I, I don't have this, you know, this uh, like craziness I had before I started my own collection. To, to I want to get everything, and that can get yes. very expensive. So it was like, yes. you know, so many, so many things out there. It's crazy. Well, you can't have just one product if there's like in one color. I can't. I need to have all colors to have the complete yeah. collection. Yeah. Adela says, I, sh I should work now, but I can't. I'm hypnotized. Hypnot oh, oh, isn't that sweet? I think, I think she's talking about the project. No, she's not. So she's beautiful. Yes. But still, I talking... believe might, might she want to say that the way you do it <laughs> make her slip. No. She's saying she's hypnotized. No. <sighs> no. Are you sure? I'm not sure. Yes. Yes, I'm sure. Careful, careful when you go very close to your camera because uh, the how you say it doesn't come now. The English word in my hand. Uh, focus. Yeah, Lo you're losing your focus. I am. God, I'm not having a good run tonight. Okay, so while that, I'm just gonna let that glue dry a little bit. So I'm going to show you, oh, hang on. No, I found some more pieces, which I can just pop in. I will tell you something, Farrell. In, mm -hmm. in that kind of compositions with molds, mm -hmm. uh, when, the, when the surface underneath, the background is a little bit rough, like has a lot of texture, I would use I would use the gel medium from Saberia, the heavy body uh, gel, instead of the uh, extra forte. Well, I wasn't sure what was going to dry quicker. It dries. No, the thing is, is it, it, it touch. I mean, you don't have many touch points now with the texture underneath. So this glue might, you don't really stick it. It's not the fault of the glue. It's the background that is, uh, has texture. So that's why the gel medium with heat gun dries uh, very, very fast. Almost instantly. Yes. Yes. Gotcha. Uh, okay. So next. Oh, we have a, I Love Mixed Media back. Hello. Hello. She was here last time. Yes. And Crafty I Am, of course. A lot of people was here. Just I I saw Love Mixed Media now and just remember it. Loving the contrast of the white, she says. Let me just quickly grab a small paintbrush because I need a small, itty bitty. Jan says, right. it's so beautiful. I love the right blue. The light, the right, sorry, the light blue. Light blue. Light blue. So, what are you going to do now? Okay, so. On here, I'm going to show you how I did the little rust bits on the corners. Ooh, oh. That's nice. So I'm going to use primer. If you have white acrylic paint, that's fine. I just have this on hand, so I'm going to use it. And it's um, just a little bit on your paintbrush. And in a dabbing motion, really lightly. Can you see what I've done there? Yeah, okay. we can see it. Very nice. Okay. Why are you using primer there? I want the white, and I don't have white um, Allegro paint. So because the primer is here, I just use that. Hello? Yes? Anybody I'm done can it. I can hear you. And Donna's? Can everyone hear me still? 
Because I think we've lost. Farrell, can you move your hands if you can hear me? Because me, I don't hear anything. So you can hear me, but I cannot hear anything. Just to know that. Okay. I don't know why. Can everyone else okay, hear gonna, me though? I'm gonna go out for a second and try to get in because somehow okay. I lost my. I you can hear me probably, guys and Farrell, but I cannot hear anything. So yeah, I'm going out and I'm getting again into okay. life. You don't have to do anything. You're gonna see Farrell. See you in a second. Okay, so next I am going to use. Matoni, Matone, Matoni, K-A-L-2-0, and the same technique. So where I've put the uh, primer, I am then going to apply the paint. That's in a dabbing motion. And what would be really, really cool is if you had the texture sand, uh, Stamperia's texture sand, and you could put that on instead of the white primer, and that would give you the texture of having rust. Bravo, um, Oh, you're there. You can hear me. Yeah, I'm back, yeah. You just scared the hell out of me. I know, I know. Um, just, yeah. I want to do so, it like that. If you have the texture sand, it would be really cool, a really cool technique because that would give you the texture of rust. But I need to buy some, so that's on my shopping list. So I'm going to dry that one. And then the next colour is... You can see it. Come on. I say it wrong every single time, and now you've given me a complex about it. And I say it in my head. <sighs> KAL one zero three Mogano. Mogano. It's okay. Mogano. Mo no, look, I think it depends on your accent. I'm going to say yeah. Mogano. You so can terrible. say dark brown. It's okay. <laughs> oh, we have Christina that probably she speaks uh, French and she says Jadot. With a lot of hearts. Oh, Bonjour. Bonjour. Sophie says, wonderful project. Thanks. Thank you, Sophie, that you're here and watching. Oh, thank you. I love I love this uh, little rust uh, spots. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, Thank Carla, you. Martinez Suarez says, brilliant Farley, don't worry about Andonis. <laughs> what did you say? Did, did, you say uh, did you say something when I did you say something about me when I was No, I didn't I didn't say a thing. You're just paranoid. Did I you, didn't say anything. Did you say no, I didn't. No, I didn't. I <laughs> Come on, no, Carla, didn't. tell me, tell me what you said about me. Write a comment. Nothing. I didn't say anything. Oh my gosh. You're gonna you're gonna pay that afterwards. <laughs> oh, no, I just dropped all my paste. Okay, so I'm going to try that. I promise I didn't say a thing. I'm sure you said something when I was gone. I didn't. You, I didn't say you was, anything. You, 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 you want it to happen like this. You want it to go for a second. <laughs> no, I didn't. Okay. So you there's my Lula. audio. <laughs> I didn't say anything. Okay, so... Next, so here's the original. So we are now going to ba, 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 vintage paste that has. Please, vintage antiquing paste. No, oh, sorry, vintage, paste. vintage and antique. Yes, okay, I said I'm sorry. Guys, you can see the big difference. Here is all about now. Nice colors, good composition, nice project, but, 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 but at the end, one more step can change the totally picture i mean it's the total the picture yeah anyway so it yeah. changes it completely yeah yeah speak your english please yes yes it completely changes it so again turpentine don't drink it no 
bit of turp in a container. Just a little. Sylvia loves your composition. Thank you very much, Sylvia. Thank you, Sylvia. Many kisses. Guys, before she does the last step, uh, thank you very much for watching. It's very important for us, for me, for Farley, for Stamberia. Thank you very much, all of you. And don't forget to share, like, and subscribe to the channel, actually, because mm -hmm. you don't miss any of the beautiful lives we have here. Can you hear me? Yes. Ah, Can you hear you me? Don't say, you don't say anything. And Sorry. I'm like, what happened? I was, I was concentrating. And I wasn't sure if you were finished talking. No, no, no. I'm okay. I'm okay. <laughs> I just say, if if by any chance you're watching from uh, from uh, Facebook, don't forget switch also to YouTube. Go there, subscribe to the channel, so Saberia TV, so you don't miss any of the notifications. Put the ring bell on. <laughs> you don't need to you to lose any of the notifications. Very important. <clears throat> so we have Trace. He says, "Love how you have bought a notebook." But brought probably he forgot they are brought an old book. Uh, brought I uh, love yep. you for work for your work, Carl. Oh, thank you, Tracy. I am a huge. My husband calls me a hoarder. I say I'm a collector. It's two different things. But old notebooks is one thing that I can't give up. Barbara if I see it. Very... Hmm. Barbara has a very important question for you, Farrell. Yes. She says, if we are new to creating Rust, okay, if we're doing that for the yes. first time, or in general, we're yes. is there a design rule or where to place it? Um, well, if you have a look at where Rust goes, normally it's in hinges or around corners of metal, um, or if there's paint peeling. So I tend to have a look at um, photos of rusty items or if I see one I'll take a photo exactly. um, I don't know if you're the, the same exactly. and Donna's and you kind of to, to oh really yeah photos are really good because you can sit there and you can kind of analyze um yeah because rust doesn't necessarily take over the whole project it's nice sure. to use it as a highlight Barbara Barbara is not okay. like we woke up, woke up in the morning and we know where to put the rust. Is is a process of, you know, living in this world. A lot of things get rusty in your yard, on the street. You know, you go somewhere, you see rusty things. You know, it's normal. So through that and through the icons, you have the pictures. And even if you Google and on Pinterest or whatever, you will see like rusty stuff. So having this in your head. Then when you're going to put it on a project, you just pretty much you want to recreate what you see in real life from real objects, right? So that's mm -hmm. why we know where to put it. So this is the best advice we can give you. And it's just practice makes perfect. The more you do it, the more comfortable you'll feel and it will just come naturally to you eventually. It's always scary that first. Like the first time you do anything. But again, you can always fix it by painting over with gesso primer. Um, but yeah, just practice. Okay, that one's just. Did I even? Yeah, I did glue that down. I'm back. Perfect. I thought you disappeared. Yeah, you know what's happening. I mean, when you go live through your phone, now the alarm, the, the alarm uh, rang before, right? So oh my somehow God. I lost my. You can see me, I can hear you. And the same happened now. The alarm starts beeping again. So, yeah. It's weird when you go with your phone, it's sometimes, you know, a lot of things can happen. Anyway, mm -hmm. loving this book, Karen says. A lot of comments. I miss some comments, but uh, people, Thank I think, they know what, what they seek, Farrell. So I won't do the back because I can do that later. 
I'd rather get this bit done so I can show you the magic. And right, one day yeah. I wish you have your own collection. Oh my gosh, wouldn't that be amazing? I know it would be amazing. And we will we will start. I love to start doing travels together and go and teach all over the world. It'll be so fun. Well, we did have lots of fun on the cruise. That was our first traveling trip together because creativation, we were busy. You were busy. Be very nice. It's time for cleaning. Did, yeah. Did, did, did you say? Did you say to everybody that it's very important, very important for this technique that they have to cover every single little bit? Uh, no, I didn't. But you just said it, so that's good. Don't forget, always. I'm sorry, yes. Yeah. Ladies, guys, if you don't put everywhere, under everywhere, what everywhere, one thousand percent. If you don't cover everything. The technique, the, the 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 style, the look is not gonna is not gonna be nice at the end. It's very important. And um, two, if you've got little nooks and crannies that you can't get into, just add more turpentine to your paintbrush to try and get in there. Yes, exactly. To make it um, softer the the paste, yeah. so you can get in. Yep. Okay. So I've got my baby wipes on hand. Yeah. Monica's handmade compendium says, love this so far. Ah, oh, thanks. And now it's time right. for magic. Okay. So you're just going to have to bear with me because my items aren't stuck down. Do it with your time. Nicole, Nicoletta, uh, she says, the Vita's paste, is it dry fast or slow? So I, I will tell you this, Nicoletta. If you use a lot of turpentine, dries faster. But you have still a couple of, maybe one hour. Maybe it depends on the weather. If it's very, if it's summer, maybe a couple of like 10, 10, 20 minutes. If it's winter, you have maybe an hour with a lot of turpentine. If you use the paste, just pure paste without turpentine, the only reason we, the only reason we use turpentine is to help the paste to, to spread the paste easier. Other, otherwise, you could do it also without turpentine. When you do it without turpentine, uh, you have a couple of hours. I mean, you, you can really clean. You don't have any problem. And if if at some point something happened, you forget about it, and the paste dries 100%, then you, what you can do, you take baby wipe, you put some turpentine on your baby wipe, and you reactivate uh, the paste. This I told you. I told you you should use. Just I this. yes, I, I know. I told but you, you went. I asked and you went missing, and then you couldn't hear me. And then I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna do this. The only thing I can say is that I told you. Oh, you no, I told you. No, no, I told you use a winter use no, medium and don't use the extra forte. <laughs> Because the background oh. has a lot of texture, but you never listen. Oh my goodness! It's not just the background; it's just not sticky. Because you are just pain in the bit. <sighs> anyway, it's okay. It'll dry by tomorrow. Well, guys, look how everything changed. Oh my god! I love this discovered color. This is like rusty, flaming. Very nice. How, uh, Farrell, how, how, mm. we, how, we, how we call in English those things we clean the ears, ear buttons? How do you say ear? Yeah, earbuds, uh, Q tip, earbuds. cotton earbuds. Um, I also use tweezers. I know it yeah, sounds weird. Maybe, maybe, yeah, very clever. And that will let me. Oh, yeah, I mean, too much. just. Is only one only one problem when you do it with this. You have to be careful to not make it like lines. Yes, like what I did just there. Yes. So that's what not to do. Yes, you, you you can clean with this. Just then you have to go also only with baby wipe to make it a little bit more distressed there, not be like a line. Yeah, Mary says 
Mon Monro or Munro. Uh, looking, looking super. I love this reveal stage. It's magic. Yeah, it's, this is mm. crazy. It I is. remember when I started teaching that, the, the first people, I mean, they start seeing this, they, they were so scared about this step. Well, it's quite daunting when you do all that hard work and then you cover it all with brown. Yeah, but bring everything oh to life, life, you know? That's it. There's something. Amanda says, just love me so much. Many, many, oh, many, thanks, many smiles. Amanda. This is hard to try. Of course, Amanda, that's why we show yes. all this. Because you have to go and try. This is what it's all about. I told you to use gel medium. I know, and I'm doing it now. Ah, now, now you use gel medium. Now you remember. Oh, I'm done. has right. Let's use gel medium. No, no. I just thought because it won't stick down, I'm better off doing it now rather than doing it later. Yes, and now because it's not dry and you have the uh, the paste, you're gonna say, "Oh, look, still moving." Yes, but not my fault. It's your fault. No. I asked you and you weren't there to, to guide me. What kind of, you know, design team boss are you if you can't guide me to using the right products? Oh, Seriously. This is a very good question. Maria, Maria from Denmark. She says, hi, Maria, how are you? Uh, by the way, so, Jan Dijks and Donis, how did you discover the paste? Oh, this is a very good story because, of course, it's not like one... One day I woke up and came in my head. Just I, when I started very early in my craft career, let's call it craft life, let's call it like this, I used to work to cooperate with one of the big art supply stores here in Athens. So they had a lot of oil, paints, and stuff for painters and, you know, uh, uh, fine art. So literally, I know this, this, this technique exists. Okay, exists for 100 years. I mean, 100%. I'm not the first who does that. But mostly in furniture and in other, in other stuff. Me, I just literally took oil with a brush, no turpentine, no nothing, and I just covered the first object I had in front of me. And, I, and then I started wiping off. But wiping off with baby wipes, I used baby wipes before because I thought it's a good idea. So then I, I adjust this to this technique and then i just found the magic for me i love this style i love vintage i i used to not do steampunk i used to do other stuff other stuff but still make them vintage and since then like five six seven years ago that technique stuck with me it is this very is cool Maria. okay so i just want to add some highlights onto the notebook. The adventure, for, for example, the chipboard, because it's very sensitive, still, guys, you can clean it more if you want. Just you have to use a little bit of turpentine on top of your, on, on your baby wipe so it's, you don't rub it so much. Still, you can make it. I mean, you can take as much as you want. So I'm just using the gloss. <laughs> I'll trust you here, Glossy Girl Heavy Body Paste. So code is K3P43. Yes, and Andonis. Amazing, Farrell. Yes. Yeah, but I'm not, doing, I'm not doing it how you want me to do it. Uh, so I've got Glamour Pigment in Burnt Umber, which is K-A-P-G-04. I'm just going to get just like a really little bit. And now I, oh, thank you very much. Um, is it Paul Porina? Bravo, yeah. very good. Yay. So code is DP03. So I used this to highlight on my last altered notebook a couple of weeks ago. Monica says, uh, just fabulous. Love highlights to bring out more details. So I have created kind of like a coppery, bronzy 
colour. And using my finger, I'm just going to go over. So I need more copper. It's better. That's beautiful. Just it's very. It's not so easy to see it in the. With the light. The top, the top left, I can see it. Yeah, very yeah. nice. It's not over the top, but it's enough to yeah. kind of um. Yeah, and of course, this color now you use match perfect with uh, turquoise underneath. So. Mm. Linda says that love the look that you created. You have to oh, be Thank nice. you. Everyone's so sweet. Thanks for staying. What time are we up? Oh, look, almost an hour and a half. It's always nice when people are watching and they're liking what you do. It's always nice to hear. So thank you to everyone. Such a nice piece of art. Valeria says, gorgeous Farrell. Valeria Rose. Valeria Rose. Thank, Thank you, Valeria. You. And that's it. Very nice. That, Bravo that was the last step. Bonito. Very nice. Put, put both, both books together to see how they look. Yeah, sure. Let me just pop my lids on because I know I'll end up spilling it if I don't. We have a very nice comment from Barbara. Uh, says, "I never thought of mixing the pigment powder together. I need to. I need to watch you more, Farrell. I usually do oh. the style, and I'm just getting into mixed media steampunk style. Very nice. Oh, thank you. Very sweet. I'm glad you like it. So they're the two books together. So this was the original one I did the other day uh, for the example. So I've just." Still kept the same concept and the same clustering, but I've just changed like the star um, sizes. Some of the chipboard pieces are a little different and the moulds, but still pretty much the same. Very nice. Very, very nice. Bravo, Farrell. Thank you. Let's it always start. helps when you've got good product to work with. Ah, oh, okay. Tell me <laughs> how much money I give you to say that. <laughs> no, that's our secret. Uh, can you come back? We want to see your face. And my face. Okay, finally, the people, I think they want to see my face also. I feel better <laughs> a little bit. Come on, okay. Farrell, come back. We want to see your yes, face, yes, 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 yes. Come on, Farrell, mm. from down and under. Let me just... Let I've got to work with it. it. We cannot see the hearts, but put some hearts. Send some hearts now in the, in the comments. Did you love what we did? Did you love what we did? I didn't do anything. I mean, far what she did. Me, I'm just being here, being the host. Very crappy day. Thank you. Uh, sorry about that. Hey, Farelito, how are you doing? I'm good. Let me just move some things out of the way and find my phone stand and then find my table. One hour, one hour and 20 minutes. You were amazing have, today. So fast. I am Bravo. getting better and better. Be better and butter. <laughs> I was waiting for it. I thought he was going to say better. something. Better. Better, and better and better. Better and better. It's two different words. Yeah, we love it. I love it. Just to show everyone. Oh, I have everyone's so sweet. Yes. Sorry about that. I I, I don't know why. I should have this mold, but I don't know where it is. Probably I you gave need to... to to Vasilis, my friend. Maybe I gave to him and I forgot to get it back. I don't know. <gasps> and I'm just looking now the project. I forgot that I have so nice uh, el elements for you know, like a set. Yeah, focal point. Um, the guy with the wings. So which way am I going? This one. Oh, yeah, it's very nice. I mean the detail. Hang on, which one am I going? I mean that on it would be awesome just to get in. Look all these little nooks and crannies. 
It's a really, really good mold set. Hilda, Hilda says, it, muchimas gracias por la hermosa clase. Uh, what does that mean? That, uh, like, and one more time, thank you very much. <laughs> okay. I'm going to Google no, it means, tomorrow. Uh, a lot, uh, thank you very, very, very much for amazing class. Oh, thank you. So you guys are awesome. For sharing beautiful projects and it's going on. All the people will show you lo the love now for you. And guys, don't forget, share, like, subscribe. Very yes. important. It's the three steps to success. Share, <laughs> like, subscribe. <laughs> success. You get a pizza box on Monday. Every yes, Monday you want a pizza box. Share, like, yes. love. Thumbs, just you everything. Know, look how nice I can be in the camera. I mean, how how nice I can talk if I don't have my nose killing me with the... <laughs> I, I came back now. I feel for, for a few seconds, I'm good now. I feel good. You are still, you're going to have to go get stronger drugs. No, I thought, I mean, they say to take one to two pills, but I take one. Sometimes I take two, but I, I think I cannot take five. I mean, it's like sometimes no, I feel you... like I need to take the whole bucket. Ah, oh, no. You need to figure that out. So, what else? Do you want to say anything else? Because you were so fast today, so you, we can spend some more time. I mean, you want something to say? To the um, people who have ladies watching now. Just, just a huge thank you to everyone for staying on tonight this morning, this afternoon, wherever you are in the world. Um, it means a lot to, especially to me, that you guys are staying and you're watching and you're commenting and you're liking. It's it's huge. So thank you very much because without you guys, we wouldn't be here. Anything else? So thank you. Uh, thank you, Wendonna. Oh, for... you finally. <laughs> I mean, if I have to ask you... For spending an hour and a half with me tonight. I mean, Thank you. What, what kind of situation is that? I mean, I have to, to beg you for... Maybe, maybe you forget to say thank you to me also being here. Look, okay. I have to admit, because tonight's been a little bit quieter than what we're normally like, you've kind of thrown me off a little bit. So I was like, oh, okay, it's going to come. It's going to happen. He's going to say something. So you threw me off. But thank you, and Donna. I know you're no, not feeling the best. So very important, you. ladies and gentlemen. Everything we are, me, Farrell, and whoever is or doing classes or being a teacher in this craft world, everything we are, we are because of you. So thank you very much for being here for one more time. Don't forget, like, subscribe, uh, share, success, and buy from Athens and Perth. And Perth. It's very nice. Online, we connect the world. Uh, everything so easy. Many kisses, millones besos, adios, hasta la vista. Como esta? See you tomorrow. Bye. Ciao. Yes. Bye. 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 Yes. Bye. Bye. See you. Bye, everybody. Kisses. Bye. 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 I call you soon. Bye. Yes. Pieces, pieces, yes. Pieces. Peace out. <laughs> oh, we are still in the show.